Okay guys, what's going on out there? I basically wanted to make this quick video on a uh, toy that I just recently picked up and I wanted to do an unboxing for you guys. I'm going to show you what it is. Grab it. Lift it up here so you guys can see it. There you go. This is called a 9bot1 uh, C+. Plus. And it's not the biggest one they have, and they make several different types of these electric unicycles is what, they're, what they are. And uh, this particular one can supposedly go from 10.5 mile an hour to 12.5 mile an hour, depending on weight and everything else like that. thought it was pretty decent speed. It's definitely not the fastest one out there, but it's pretty, pretty quick for me, not ever riding one of these. Um, and it has, I forget the range on it, I think it's like 12 miles or something like that, uh, that you can get off one charge. This, this particular company, Ninebot, uh, I guess actually bought Segway. So they're using a lot of their technology, a lot of the balancing uh, mechanisms in these are basically part of the Segway brand. And uh, they do uh, make a smaller version of the Segway. Now the Segway, it's kind of expensive. I think they're around seven, eight thousand dollars. Maybe some of them are higher than that, depending on what options you get on them. And that's a uh, too far out of our range to even think about. Uh, I was also looking at they have what they call the Segway. Uh, I don't even know if it's called the Segway, but it's a Pro Mini, and that is controlled by your knees. They don't really have handlebars like the Segways do. The the X twos, I believe. Let me start off by doing this unboxing for you. We'll get it all. Uh, opened up and see what comes in the box. Alrighty, so get my knife in there. Hope you guys can see this all right. You know, every once in a while you'll get online, you'll see something pretty cool uh, to try, and uh, try and use. So. Okay, let's see what we got inside this box here. Now, I will say, uh, from what I've seen online, they definitely look a little smaller to me online than they do in person. And also, it weighs a pretty good amount. This basically comes in at 30 pounds. here and it looks like we have uh, the charger for it there you go okay from what I read I think these are uh, for training purposes so you don't scratch up the sides or anything like that I believe they're uh, let's open them up let's see there we go yeah, see it comes with uh, some 3M tape, and I'm not really sure how this goes on yet. I'm going to have to read up on that, uh, but it's got like little foam pads or something like that, so uh, you don't scratch up the unit. This looks like, uh, oh, this looks like an extension for the air to fill the, the tire up, so they give you a tool for that, which is good because... I did see online to where the uh, uh, where you fill the air out bad is, is buried up in there so an extension is probably going to be good and let's see what we got really not too much in the box uh, you have your unit now I think the, the you know they, they just look pretty cool you know I was just interested in it when I seen it and I uh, thought, man, that'd be a fun thing to, to use up at the Ford if I get up there with it. So, And there it is. Okay, it's supposed to have a handle up here, which it does. You guys can see that. So you can pick it up. Closes back in. Okay, so it looks like this is the plug to charge it right here. 
flip the handle up, spin it around. This is going to be your on and off button. I don't know if you guys can see that too much, but good. Or there you go. There's your on and off button. It's got these pads on the side for your legs. And of course it's got the flip down pads for your for your feet. It also has uh, these grips on the pat on the foot pedals too, which are pretty cool. Give you a closer look. There's the pads. And maybe I can turn it on for you guys real quick. This is supposedly show, supposed to show you the charge of it. Pretty cool looking though, isn't it? Now you're not supposed to pick this up when it's on. I don't know if it's the smartest thing to do, so I'm going to shut it off. And what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to go ahead and charge it up. I don't know how long. Let me check real quick for you guys. So basically guys, the only thing that comes in this box is going to be the unit, the charger, some instructions and padding to help protect the unit while you're learning and a tire uh, valve extender other than that that's it that's all it's in the box that you get I'm gonna open this up real quick because I want to give you guys some basic information on this uh, it, it, it does, you do have to put an app in your phone, I believe, and that will show you the speed, distances, and everything else. I haven't used it yet, so when I get to that point, I will go over that with you guys if you're interested. Um, and this is basically going over some safety precautions, what to do, what not to do, how to charge it. Um, now it does go up inclines. I don't know how steep of an incline it can go up, but I, I'm, I'm assuming it goes up pretty good incline, which we don't have a lot of down here in Florida, but uh, it's nice to know you can go a little bit off-road with it. I've seen people online, on YouTube, doing some crazy stuff going off-road. Uh, also, it just tells you how to clean it. You can wipe it down. It's no problem going into water. As long as it's not flooded out, you should be okay. You know, you don't want to hose it down or anything like that, but if you're running, you know, in the rain or something like that, as long as it's not a, a downpour, it should be fine. I'm, I myself is probably not going to going to be doing that, but all right. So basically, guys, I'm going to go ahead and start to get this charged up. And then when I get it charged up, I'll probably make another video of it. Uh, I'll probably scoot around with it. I don't know if you guys want me to even try to do a video that's showing me how to you know learn how to even use this but my main my main goal of getting this is I thought it'd be cool to take it around the fort maybe get some different footage for you guys and I got at a really good deal uh, the you know just a disclaimer the company did not give it to me and I didn't I'm not doing this for any kind of money I basically bought this myself and I want to just show it to you guys so with that being said stick around i'm going to show you a few more things on it once i get it charged up and tinker with it a little bit and see how i do and then uh hopefully you guys will enjoy some videos maybe of this let me know in the comments if not i'll kill the project but if if so i'll go ahead and make another video down the road uh actually using the nine bot one c plus all right guys we'll talk to you soon